So in this video, I'm going to dry pour a 12 foot by 8 foot concrete pad. And I just couldn't think of any, any way that would be more fun than just axing these uh, bags up and, you know what I mean, getting the old blood pumping and see how quick we can do this. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, that's satisfying. Okay, well, that was fun. So, my dad came over and visited me today. He saw this big old mess I'm making. He says, why didn't you just rent a cement mixer? And do it that way. It seems like it'd be a lot easier. I was showing him the difficulty I was having getting it flat. And it's not actually difficult. I'm just kind of lazy. And I was wanting to think of the easiest way to do it. Fastest way to do it. So I'm like, Dad, you pick up the bag, dump it into the concrete mix, grab another one, tear them open, dump them in, Squirt water in there. Wait, 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 wait. Dump it back out into a wheelbarrow. Wheel it over here. Dump it out. And unless you have more than one person, you cannot do a section like this. You can't do it. Because you'll dump it out, and it'll be hard before you get all the rest mixed, because every time you're dumping, someone's got to be doing this, water hosing it, Uh -uh. So, dry pouring it, as long as it doesn't rain and I can put a tarp over it if it does, we're not in a hurry. We're not done until we want to be done. I am literally just going to pour this out and spray it with water hose and we're going to be done. But getting it flat is the problem. Now, here's, here's why. Think about it. If this was being poured wet the way... It normally is. I got rocks in my uh, in my lucky concrete shoes. Um, when it's wet, just think of like spreading peanut butter. You take a you take a butter knife or a trowel. And you can just you can just see yourself smoothing on a mix of concrete, but this is dry, so it doesn't move like a wave. You can't push it around. I'm going to try to get at least halfway full of cement, and I did soak the bottom, soak the ground pretty good. Um, about an hour ago, and that's important so that water can come up into this slab from the ground. Um, and I know I have to add more concrete, uh, but we're going to put the, that mesh down. Those professional concrete guys, shit, they make it all look easy.
Well, I've wrestled with it long enough and I'm gonna mist it down a little bit. I mean, that's hard to beat. It looks better than the stuff I did the last couple nights. Well, I feel like there were lessons learned. Yeah. <laughs> lessons learned. Some fun was had. I do have a pretty, a pretty great, uh, pad to build a nice building on which I've never done that before either stay tuned I'm over it uh, Bob V looking kiss my oh.